ShireSociety.com. And this gentleman's waiting also. Oh. Did they, they don't have any pay for it. But it, we don't have, uh, do we have room? I mean, it's standing. I, I have no idea. I'm not okay. Even. okay. And, well, no, it's not. The argument has begun. So usually when our TV crews come, they come at 9 o'clock and set up early. Um, this is just a tough day. So let me just go in and see what room we have. If there's no room, there's no room. I can't make room in the space that, that we don't have because this is highly unusual to have to bring in extra um, benches and everything. I don't actually need to set anything up. I don't really even need to film it there much. Uh, any, uh, I just want to bring my equipment in so I can get back out. Oh, yeah, it's fun. Yeah, actually, I was, I was here a couple weeks ago uh, watching the arguments. I saw your argument. You did, did a really nice Yeah, how'd it go? <laughs> um, what were you arguing? Uh, nothing as interesting as this. Um, what was it? Uh, it was um, whether or not we were on the Question for you. Sure. Uh, you're one of the you're one of the plaintiffs' attorneys, is that right, correct? Yeah, I'm the lead attorney for the plaintiffs. I'm with Americans ask, United uh, for separation of church and state. Okay. Well, I can certainly respect a respect for the Constitution, but what about what about students' First Amendment rights in these government schools? Do they even have any? They're not allowed to film for the most part. Uh, I'm not sure if I understand your question. Well, there, for instance, there was an incident in Manchester schools where a young man was threatened by his teachers and told to delete his video because he filmed one of the uh, school resource officers beating up on a student. So you like the Constitution. I like the Constitution. There's a there's a free speech passage in the in the state constitution. But yeah, I'm not actually familiar with that. Uh uh, Jill over here is with the ACLU. Uh, he might know more about it. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. Well, what about the Second Amendment rights in schools too? I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, not, I'm not talking about Second Amendment, but the state, the state, the state says that you've got the right to have guns pretty much anywhere but in the state constitution. Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, not, I'm not familiar with these other issues, so I can't get real. But you're trying to put people into places where these rights are not respected. I don't know if it's a fair question how you think it went um, today in your argument. I think uh, you can never predict how a court's going to rule. Um, you know, I think the justices uh, asked very good questions. They, uh, they've they clearly thought about this uh, case very closely. Um, so we're, uh, we'll be cautiously optimistic. Hopefully they'll uh, rule in our favor, as the Superior Court did. And uh, you know, we'll just hold our breath. It might take a few months. Before we know. The old world is collapsing, and it's going to take its slave driver governments with it. But what will rise up in their place? In New Hampshire, the Shire Society has a plan, a thriving web forum, and a history of action. Take long to come up with a plan. You can sign up right now at ShireSociety.com.